I don't know how you guys want to do it. Do you want it to be a stand-up kind of thing? Is standing up cool? Or if not, we can make it more intimate vibe and have everyone kind of like sit on the floor, crisscross applesauce and shit. Like. <laughs> Yay! All right, so right here we are doing some cookie decorating in uh, celebration of Pride Month, so people can have cookies. We're decorating; they can decorate their own cookies. Just to, so to spread the word, get people thinking. This month we have a comedian coming on the 10th. We have a party this weekend in Paces called Wet Ladies Faces at Paces, and it's going to be really great. We have a DJ from Philly coming in. It's going to be catered. We also have a uh, queerness and mental health workshop coming up as well, and that should be really good. Get the conversation started. Also, we have the Trans Day of Remembrance Vigil on November 20th. Three, two, okay, so welcome to the uh, Queer Open Night. We got a lot of acts coming up. We have some people dancing. We got some poetry. We've got some stand-up. It should be a good time. It's super fun. Yeah. Yeah. Squaw. identified as bisexual at the downtown Panda Express. My mom, she said she expected it. I didn't. I still don't. There's something to be said about being confused. Behind this door was a crowd of people staring into my broken sternum, painting my identity with their perception of it. When I found motivation to leave that dark space, it was never for her, even though I was, am, wasn't bisexual, and it should have been. <laughs> 